And so you, your story is, is unique and different from those around you. And it deserves to be told, you know? And you can discover that from painting and just tapping into yourself and discovering how you're a little bit different from someone else around you. <laughs> Tony, your husband is that same engineer. I love it. I love it. Um, so, you know, you can, and you can, a lot of how you decide to tell the story is how you decide to, what palm fronds you decide to define, what um, texture you decide to have, what, um, this is, this is how you develop as an artist and how you tell your story. And you know, like I 100% started off as this artist. You know, that's, this was a good solid. I've only recently evolved into being able to do this. You know, it's, it's, well, I mean, y'all saw that still life that I had from 10 years ago. Um, I wasn't even really, you know, I, I was a beginner beginner. And then you get a little bit more comfortable and you start being able to like push things and experiment and you get, you realize that there is no such thing as failure. There's just learning. And as soon as you can realize that there's no such thing as failure, that's when you really unleash this powerful force within yourself. Um, because then you realize the world is your oyster and you can have a pink and blue palm tree and it's okay and it's beautiful and it reflects who you are and it reflects your joy and your creativity. So, you know, that's, that's why during this entire process of this painting, I don't want anyone to feel like it's an impossible thing. I don't want anyone to think they can't do it because you can and you start off with realism and you start off learning the rules and as you learn the rules more, you learn where it, you're comfortable and where you can push the rules and where you can start breaking the rules and then you start just sprinting and you start just running and this entire evolution is a really beautiful process. And whether you are a beginner and you've never picked up a brush before, you will progress. If you focus on the journey, um, you will progress. You know, if you don't compare it, the second I stopped comparing myself to other people, I started making progress. I started being able to push things. I started, you know, really discovering who I was as an artist. And um, so don't compare yourself to others. You know, we are all on a different journey at a different pace. And uh, your journey is your journey. You're never behind is something I like to say. Um, thank you, Betsy. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a splashy, sunny vibe. It's uh, part of my journey was we were in North Carolina and I was trying to show my work in North Carolina and I kept having people ask me if I was from Florida because I had a lot of color in my work. And so we eventually wound up moving to Florida and it's been a really good fit for me. So that was part of me discovering my journey. Um, you know, we're, we're all just in this universe trying to figure it out and we're all human. And so this is where we can use our story and discover our humanity.